Exactly. Dear Papa, how is everybody? And uh, so on and so on. Ah, ah, here we go. This uh, year, I'm entering the shower flow. No. The coward's toe? Uh, no. <laughs> the flower show. <laughs> That's it. Uh, at the castle gardens. So could you send me some weeds? Uh, I mean seeds. Uh, from the most beautiful and unusual plant on Kura Kura Dot. Thank you, your faithful friend and daughter, Pippi. Well, let's see. Um, ooh, how about those? Oh, you wouldn't send a cannibal flower? Is that what they're called? Oh, yes, sir. And this is why. <laughs> they're a kind of Venus flytrap. They'll eat anything they can reach. But they are beautiful and unusual. Uh, that they are, sir. But I'm sure it will be all right, <laughs> as long as we add a note of explanation. <laughs> well, I hope so, sir. But I wouldn't bet on it. For Pippi Longstocking uh, from Kerbal Gurble Gut. Kerbal Gurble Gut? I didn't know I knew anyone there. Oh, yeah, maybe it says uh, Kura Kura Dot. <laughs> yes, it must. Father sent the seeds. Hooray! Boy, they're big ones. Throw that wrapping away, Mr. Nelson. I'll get the flower pots ready. <laughs> this will make a perfect greenhouse. Way. Was there a letter or something telling us what kind of flower it is? Oh. No? Oh well, I guess Father wants to surprise me. There. Now all they have to do is grow. Hey, 
Pippi, are you home? I'm in the greenhouse! Wow, those have gotten giant. That's for sure. They're going to need more room soon. This one's bigger than I am. What do the flowers look like? They look like flowers, I suppose. I mean, if they look like French horns, I'd have to find a French horn show to enter. And I don't even think there are any this year. Hey, my candy cane. Quit fooling around, Tommy. I didn't take it. All right. I'm warning you. You better give it back. Uh, here it is, Mrs. Priscillius, your flower show entry form. It's about time. It's at the Castle Gardens this year, you know. Oh, is that where they have that big maze? They say you get lost as soon as you go in. Maze? What maze? Oh, that. Oh, I haven't time for fun and games. I've got geraniums to grow. And prizes to win. Uh, bye. Hope you lose. What? I guess so. <laughs> Aren't there a lot of them? I may have planted one or two too many. <coughs> Mr. Nilsson doesn't mind. I'm only taking the best to the flower show. I'll replant the rest outside. Oh, that reminds me. Here's your entry form. <laughs> Excellent, thanks. Well, there's a postcard for you, too. Now, what could have happened to it? Oh, well, never mind. It was from your father, wishing you good luck. That's nice. It's a good thing you read it. Oh, I always do. Just part of the service. I hope you win a prize. Oh, I'm sure to. Nobody else is going to have flowers like these. Thanks for coming. I didn't know you were so interested in flower shows. We're not. We want to try that maze. But we'll come to the flower show, too, if we have time. <laughs> Good heavens! What are those? Flowers, Mrs. Priscilla. I'm going to enter them in the flower show. Those? Those elephants? Those monsters? Don't you know that flowers should be delicate and graceful? Like my geraniums. These are the kind of flowers that win prizes at the Royal Flower Show. Well, maybe they'll have more than one prize. They could have a hundred and it wouldn't matter. <laughs> See you there. She's a bad sport and the contest hasn't even started. Just ignore her, Pippi. I'll try. <laughs> but sometimes it's not so easy. Geraniums! Mind! Gone! Police! Murderers! Help! Oh, hello, Mrs. Priscillius. Are you here? Well, of course I'm here. 
No thanks to that criminal who attacked my precious pets. Did you know some of my prized geraniums were stolen right off my windowsill? That's terrible! Who did it? I don't know. But if I ever catch him, he'll be sorry. Here it is! And it's huge! This ought to be fantastic. Oh, look at this baby! He's uh, so cute! Annika, come on! See you later! Path, I would have seen him. He must have followed those children into the maze. Come on! That way! Edward! Now let's see. Beautiful, beautiful. Just stay right where you are, my pets. What on earth? Is there anyone out there? A baby's lost! What's the matter? What's happened? They went in to look for a lost baby and they got lost. Oh, preposterous. Uh, I suppose that means a rescue party. I'll lead, of course. Now form a line so we know exactly where we've been. Uh, I, I don't think... This instant, we haven't time to waste. Follow me! Watch where you're going. This way. Where are we? Egbert! Egbert! That way! Which way now, Christopher Columbus? Uh, I'm not sure. Well, I am. I'm sure we're lost! That ought to do it! Where is everyone? What's going on out there? Now you be good while I'm gone. <laughs> Strange! Everyone's disappeared. Well, here's someone. But where are your parents? <laughs> Running away from home, eh? Well, you can never get started too young. I guess I'll just have to watch you. I know. I'll tell you a story. How about the monster of the maze? <gasps> Ooh. No, the fiend of the flower show. No, the ghastly ghost in the garden. <laughs> no, I have a better idea. <laughs> Let's just go for a walk. Well, uh... Look! There's someone up there! Thank goodness we're found! That's good because we're lost. Here comes someone else! Oh. 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 Do you know how to get out of here? Certainly not! Then we're all lost. What about the baby? Bert, is that you? <laughs> I bet it is. You look sort of egg birdie. Huh? They must have gotten lost looking for you. Come on, 
soon, Mr. Nilsson. Wait, maybe there's a... Yes. Now, you take this end in and give it to them while I stay here and hold the other end. And hurry up! Mr. Nelson. Oh. Hooray! 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 Sounds like they're getting desperate. They've got the rope. Now I can pull them out. Don't worry, I'll rescue you! <laughs> <laughs> Trouble? That's Egbert. But he didn't cause any trouble. He's the only one who didn't get lost. Attention. Attention, please. Professor Enneberg has arrived. The judging is about to begin. Come on! <laughs> Everyone return to their exhibits at once. Professor? Professor? Yes? What? Oh, oh, yes. The, the show. Yes. Absurd. <gasps> I must say, this is the noisiest flower show I was ever at. You, you did this. You were jealous. That's a lie. You're the cheater. Me? Why, you, you... Oh! And the most violent. Mrs. Priscillius? What are you doing down there? Did you get a muscle cramp or something? Leave me alone. I'm going to catch that flower stealer if it's the last thing I do. Oh, well, good luck. Nobody's going to believe this when we get home. Now, let me see. This is a, a, oh, yes, an anemone. That's odd. I could have sworn I had a pencil. Uh, uh, uh. Stop! Stop! Help! Gosh, give it back! This instant! <gasps> Mrs. Priscillius? The, the flower did it! It's the flower! I think she's finally cracked up. It must have been that cramp. 
I have not. I am perfectly sane. That flower just swallowed my geranium. Uh huh. Of course it did, Mrs. Priscillius. And we'll make it give it back. Why don't you just lie down? Think what, you idiot? I'll prove it to you. Oh! Oh! Give me that! That flower is strong! <laughs> yes! You see? You see? My geranium! So that's what Father Surprise was. Pretty good, I'd say. Police, arrest that flower. It's a dangerous criminal. Criminal? Interesting. Very interesting. Oh, no. Uh, Professor, there's something you ought to know. Yes? Never mind. But are my flowers really criminals? Criminals? No. I knew they weren't. Cannibals, yes. These are cannibal flowers which grow on certain islands in the South Seas. Like, uh... Curacuridot? Exactly. But they've been crossed with some of our own plants. Now, how could that happen? Oh, the old pots. I planted them in some old flower pots. They must have swallowed the seeds that were left. Remarkable. Quite remarkable. Absolutely remarkable. There. Now you better stay there and not cause any more trouble. In fact, you ought to be ashamed of yourselves. You can't go around just eating things, even if you are cannibal plants. I hope you're listening. Do you think they understand? It's hard to tell with plants. That was just in case. Attention. Attention. Professor Enneberg will now award the grand prize. Professor? What? Uh, uh, oh, yes. Well, what? The prize, yes. Well, uh, let, let me see. There were some uh, very nice peonies. And some very attractive anemones. And some excellent geraniums. <laughs> but the grand prize goes to Pippi Longstocking for her remarkable achievement of crossbreeding cannibal flowers with local plants. Yay, Pippi! Oh, ridiculous. You won! You're the champ! Congratulations, Pippi! You wait, that's not all. Eh, uh, from now on, the new flower will be known as Omnivera Pippidensis, or Hungry Pippi. Hungry Pippi. What a beautiful name for a flower. That reminds me, I haven't eaten all day. Where are the refreshments? Come on! Preposterous. Deplorable. Unthinkable. Ridiculous. Oh, oh, no, 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 not oh, again. Really. 